let's take a look at the chart action for litecoin okay so here's what i'm looking at on the litecoin chart i'm on the daily time frame right now and it kind of looks like a, a, a diamond pattern or maybe possibly a flag pattern but it looks like we're breaking out of this uh downtrend right here we had resistance we had resistance and then we had support and support so that could potentially be a flag pattern in which you would target from the bottom of the pole to the top of the pole and then drag that to the breakout which would be something like that which would give you a target of approximately 122.17 or you could also i mean usually a diamond pattern and i don't know i mean i think a diamond pattern is usually a reversal pattern and in that case you would drag from the bottom to the top of like the middle of the that diamond uh since we're breaking out to the upside this would be a target of approximately 119.82 but usually um i think this is more going to the downside but i'm not sure it, it kind of looks like a flag pattern though so i don't know either one of those the other thing i wanted to show you though is if you zoom out um in my in general i think a 105 dollar litecoin i put in a position at 104 but i think a, a 100 dollar litecoin is kind of seems kind of cheap because in the last two runs it hit uh, pretty much 400 400 right here and 400 right here so there's definitely a potential to go up that much and if it did go back to 400 i mean it put, could potentially break out of that but um i would say if it did go back to around 400 then 220 or 292 percent 271 percent and then let's say even 300 let's say you start taking profits like at 300 um 180 percent which is the previous top right here so we went up to 400 right here and then we hit 300 right here uh there might be some resistance right here honestly i i, I wouldn't doubt if it kind of like did i don't know we'll see let's see if it, it can keep going i think the first spot that we'd have to break is a this previous top right here which could be uh some resistance let's go ahead and draw a horizontal line this one is going to be at 115 so there might be some resistance at 115 but i think if it can break 115 then we can start looking at next previous tops which the next one would be at 135 maybe 166 and then uh or maybe 232 this like i said the 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 previous the, the last previous high was 300 so um and yeah that was like 180 some percent or something so yeah i think if we could break 115 then we're we're gonna go higher and, and then if we look in the short term too like if you want to just try to trade this like quickly let's go ahead and just delete everything let's actually not delete that yellow line basically we're in an uptrend right now and it kind of looked like a channel pattern let me delete everything else as far as the uh, the shorter time frame so right now we're in the four hour time frame and let's go ahead and I, I feel like there's a top right there and a top right here top and top giving me a trend line something like that except i deleted it one second there it goes and then so you would drag from the bottom of the channel to the top of the channel drag this to the breakout and even if you like even just like a small i mean even a small trade i i or a small target i think would be 110 in the short term right now like i said we're at 104 so i don't know in general i think there's uh some potential in here like i said on the the bigger time frame so it might take some time for us to or it might take some time for everything to start kicking in but i think there's some potential there but just my opinion let me know what you guys think if you guys like the video hit the thumbs up and i'll see you in the next one